Hey, look, it's Emily's birthday party. The girls are getting around to taking some cool photos, but something's definitely not right here. While these pics are all okay, the problem is they're just that. And we all know that for our gang, average is not an option. Here comes Jacob. He brought a cool gadget to get the party going. It's a bubble making machine. How about you use it to your advantage? See, the girls cheer up instantly. Why don't you hold it for us a bit higher, Jacob? Let's start with our birthday girl. The bubbles definitely add a sense of whimsical to the background and lighten up the scene. Your photography subject will be more distracted so they won't have time to make the stiff, unnatural expression that we all know from our school photos. That's so much better, isn't it, girls? It seems they forgot about someone. No worries, Jacob. You'll make it into some pictures next time. How's it going, Emily? Looking for some inspiration for your next Instagram pics? These are all too plain to get any attention. Jacob, what do you think about this? Have we all run out of ideas? He definitely has something on his mind. Here, hold his water, Emily. Good thing you already have two coffee tables. Now a whole bowl of ice. You're not doing the ice bucket challenge, are you? That's so 2014. Lastly, a sturdy glass frame. Emily still doesn't get it. So ice goes on glass and we're a bit puzzled too. Guess you should go under there, girl. Great, see where we're going with this now? Act as if you were a mermaid trapped under ice. We won't be getting such pics in a natural environment anytime soon. But we don't think you'd like to try that anyway. So enjoy this clever use of all things transparent. Wow, Emily, you look like an ice queen in the winter slumber, about to break free from an icy prison. Well, those likes seem to be coming in nicely, Emily. All that hard work on social media has really made Jacob thirsty. Would you mind giving him a glass of water? Huh? That's a cool optical illusion. Maybe we could use it sometime. There you go. Oh, but wait a second. Say cheese, Jacob. Now look what we have here. The glass full of water bends and twists the light like a lens or a funny mirror. You know, like the ones you see in the Hall of Mirrors at fun fairs. Whatever passes through it reaches your eyes in an unexpected way. You don't have to stick to your own face. Play with shapes and patterns you can find around the house. Stripes turn into waves. Leaves duplicate. Faces bend and swirl. The only limit is your imagination. From abstract to funky to funny. The possibilities are endless if you take a look through the looking glass. Okay guys, stand a bit closer. Switch poses. Yeah, that's the spirit. Hey Jacob, why don't you do a plank now? And Emily can do a plank on you. Cool, for sure some of those pics will do. Hey look, here's our whole gang coming back from their classes. Sup guys? Come here, let's do a group photo. Quick, leave your jackets. This is gonna be cool. Wow, isn't this amazing? Human rainbow all the way. They must have had this planned all along. Come, take a look. And while this setup does require a bit of planning, we can't think of a better picture to celebrate how different we all are, yet still one big family. Anna's home, browsing through the selfies she took today. Sharp shadows, a beginner mistake. Maybe you can take some better ones right now. To be honest, home lighting isn't any better either. Guess you have to wait until tomorrow and hope for good weather. Or find something that will work as a makeshift light diffuser. Bed sheets? Perfect! White color reflects light, which means your face is evenly lit. Bye bye, nasty shadows! Anna got so inspired, there's got to be more to this hack. Curtains? Ah, yes, that's the idea. If you're bored with plain light, See what will happen if you take a picture under see-through curtains. The shadow play of dancing patterns make for an always captivating photo. Like from an old George Michael video. Remember that one? It does look a bit silly from the outside, but it's the inside that counts. Isn't it, Anna? 
One more break in the park to brush up on that knowledge, Jacob. Emily's right there on the phone to remind you of what's really important. Wow, look at the composition of that pic. Would you like to send her something back? Well, it can't be anything too obvious. Trees, sky, grass, she's seen it all already. Oh, would you look at that? Once again, your book provided the answer. Take a picture before the sun hides behind the clouds again. You can do something similar with other roundish objects you have lying around. Perfect. Now let's wait for her response. Well, of course she likes it. It's amazing to see you putting your heart into your vision. These rainy pictures look so deep and romantic. But how can Anna recreate the same effect? What's the weather like? Wow, seems the sun isn't going anywhere today. So should you wait until the weather gets worse? Or maybe we can figure out how to speed it up. After all, a picture frame is also a window of sorts. Once you remove the picture itself, grab a water sprinkler and spray the glass thoroughly with water. We're talking real rain effects here, so it has to drip a little. The only thing that's left is to take some selfies. Be sure the camera focuses on you, add some cool lighting, and enjoy the stunning effects. Hey Crafty Pandas! I hope you're enjoying this video as much as Jacob is. Let us know just how much by smashing that like button. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And most importantly, don't forget to leave a comment down below. We read them all. Jacob thinks Anna looks charming, even doing something as simple as washing dishes. In the crowded kitchen, it's hard to get the right angle. Jacob, this is irritating. Give me some space, she said. But Jacob is determined he can get the shot. Oh, wait a minute. That's perfect. We'll use the rinser to create a lovely lighting pattern illusion and give the image a dreamy, playful look. <laughs> Emily got inspired to update her profile picture with a cute and playful image. So Sarah is going to help her out. Maybe we should use a household item like a pillow. Nope, too cliche. How about a can of Coke? Darn it, the whole shirt is a mess now. Wait, don't worry. Sarah has a brilliant idea. Emily, go ahead and stand up. Give Sarah a second to dress you up with a handful of flowers. Or keep you hydrated with a slice of watermelon. Just like that, in a second, Emily becomes a part of nature. Jacob just installed Tinder to find a date. First things first, he needs to set up his profile picture. Next up, a lot of right swiping. Unfortunately, it looks like Jacob has no matches so far. This photo is clearly not helping him. Jacob needs to figure out how to make his profile stand out a bit. And a toy Lambo might just be the tool to make it happen. Let's grab a shoebox, throw the junk out, and put all these extra props inside. Hey Jacob, don't forget the jacket. It might be chilly outside. The denim jacket, the cap, and the shades make Jacob look like a real ladies man. Cover the box with grass. We'll need it in a second. Ask someone to help you out with this photo project. Luckily, Emily is just passing by and can be your photographer for today. Do you mind helping us out with the photo? Perfect. Put the car on top of the box and hold the camera just a foot away. Jacob now needs to stand a bit further away in order to compensate for the small size of the toy car. After a couple of shots, Emily has managed to get the perfect bad boy photo. It's a shame. Boys can be so clueless with the girls that are clearly into them. It's time to swap out your old profile picture with the new one, meaning we're back to swiping.
Finally, it's a match. Now we're in business. Hi, love your car. Good luck with the date, Jacob. Hope it turns out well. Hey, paparazzi pandas. I hope you enjoy these photography hacks. Let us know which of them you're going to use next in the comments down below. If you want to learn more, feel free to check out our older videos, hit the subscribe button, and ring that bell to stay tuned for more.